Hi teachers, welcome back to our class. Today we are going to discuss practical life exercises. Practical life exercises are some activities related to our daily life. Here the child works with objects and materials used in day to day life. Cleaning, sweeping, dressing, pouring etc. The aim of practical life exercise is to help the child to get coordination and control of movement. Let's learn the classification of practical life exercises. There are four classifications. Preliminary exercises, applied applications, grace and courtesy, control of movement. Now let's have a look at the preliminary exercises. Preliminary exercises are carrying a mat, unrolling and rolling a mat, carrying a chair, sit and stand from a chair, carrying a table, carrying a tray, carrying a jug, geometric cabinet tray, carrying a sharp object, opening a door, removing a book, opening a book, turning pages of a book, opening bottles, opening boxes, folding clothes, pouring grains and pouring grains. The second classification comes under practical life exercise is applied applications. Applied applications are again classified into two. Care of the person and care of the environment. Okay teachers, let's have a look at the exercises under care of the person. There are four exercises, washing hands, dressing frame, polishing shoes and preparing a snack. Dressing frame includes button, snaps, hook and eye, zipper, buckle, bow, lacing and safety pins. Next one is care of the environment. Here the child learns how to clean our surroundings. The exercises are washing a chalkboard, dusting a table, washing a table, polishing wood, polishing glass, arranging flowers, washing clothes, setting a table, sweeping, wet mopping, dust, dust mop mopping and outdoor sweeping. The third one is grey sand courtesy. Here the child learns these activities, introduction, greeting a person, thank you, excuse me, introduction of oneself, yawning, coughing, interrupting, offering help, expressing admiration. The last classification of practical life exercise is control of movement. It includes two activities, walking on the line and silence game. Now you have learned practical life exercises and its classifications. Okay teachers, we will be back with sensorial exercises. Thank you.